It's not the camera, it's me. <laughs> oh, today's gonna be a fun day. Today. Good morning, yes. Oh, good morning. Oh, we gotta <laughs> intro the, the video. First and foremost, welcome back to our channel. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to another day. I'm not saying that. You're gonna say another day, another vlog. Yeah, it's just, it's so catchy. Someone's been watching Jess and Gabe. I put on a hat to preserve your eyes. We're getting up and we're gonna take you along with today because a lot of people have been requesting a vlog and we were like, what are we even doing today? Because it feels like yeah. it's such a blur. Also, this angle is probably the worst angle you could possibly choose. How do you think I, I feel? Mean, Look at these. I'm wondering why you chose to literally do this, this angle. I don't, what do you want me to do? Hi, welcome back to our channel. Today we're super beautiful and super sweet and everything's perfect. Hashtag like and subscribe. Oh my gosh, this oh. is, if you're wondering why we don't vlog, this is why. This is why, but we love you. It's guys. so hard to vlog. We actually have to film a separate YouTube video this morning to go live this morning. It's one of those raw, unet, unet, wow, mm -hmm. it's gonna go about like that. It's one of those raw, this video will be edited. <laughs> the one we're gonna post today is unedited, yeah. where it's just one of those raw and real conversations. Mm -hmm. And the topic kind of was spurred upon a, a big meeting that we had with our team last night mm -hmm. and just kind of, be like, wow, where are our days going? We feel like we blink and the week's gone. And yeah. it'll be fun to kind of create this like a like a video diary almost of like mm -hmm. what we actually do in a day. Mm -hmm. And so we're gonna get up and I'm gonna, if you guys saw our old morning routine, yeah. you guys know I like my fluids in the morning. So I'm gonna get up and yeah. like try to feel like a human being. Yes. And then we're gonna knock out this YouTube video and then we'll see what the day has to hold. Let's do it. My arm hurts so bad. Oh. Are you guys real tree people or fake tree people? We are real tree people because we see the light. So I'm so sorry. I just got to get all these lights on so I can see up in here. Let's do. Is that a flex? That's a flex if I've ever seen one. I'm not even mad at it. It does take a minute to get all these on though. I wish I had like all the, what, what's it called? The. The lights where you you can do it from your phone or you can tell like, like a clapper. That would be pretty sweet. Good morning, you guys. Good morning. It's time for me. Does it look really dark? Is that okay? It looks crooked. Dude, I think you have to lose. I think that's straight. I'm gonna go have some quiet time. You need it. <laughs> it's getting too loud in here. First thing you need is a good cup of coffee because the best part of waking up is coffee in your cup. Now I'm gonna show you guys everything I use for my morning fluid routine, which again, we need to work on that name. It's the name, the name is not working. We need to figure something out with that. If you have any recommendations, feel free to comment below. We've realized that we've been really struggling with our energy levels. Actually, specifically Tori's been struggling with her energy levels and her like gut. She's always had digestive issues and sometimes it's better than others. And for me, I just feel like sometimes I just can't wake up. I don't know if you guys ever feel like that where you're just like, I'm awake, but I'm not like awake, I'm not there. And I think that's probably why I need this bad boy. Yeah, the second sip is even better than the first. For the past few weeks, we've been trying this product called AG1 by Athletic Greens. And it's an all-in-one supplement that is has over 75 vitamins, minerals, probiotics, whole foods. It's incredible. And what I love about it is it helps us not be so high maintenance because in the past, when Tori and I have used like uh, a bunch of pills or something to get everything we need, first off, I can't do that because my stomach gets upset. I can't handle that. What I love about this AG1 is that everything comes in this can right here. Everything that we need, all the nutritional needs is right here. And with simply just putting one scoop into a cup and then filling it up with water, you shake it up and then you're good to go. You have everything you need that's gonna fill those nutrient gaps. And we've absolutely been loving it. It is helping me with my recovery and it is helping me with my immunity, which is something that we all should be focusing on right now, especially during the winter months and everything that's happening in the world. So I definitely recommend you guys check out this product. And if you do actually check it out right now in the link in our bio, they're offering two additional little freebies to go along with it, which one of those is this vitamin D dropper, which for me, I was always told how important it is to have vitamin D in your diet. So with two or three drops a day, you get that and you're just off to the races. And we've noticed that 
you need better fuel, good in, good out, bad in, bad out. And so when we are fueling ourselves with the right things that aid our immunity, things that help our energy, help us recover, these types of things are gonna help us operate our best. And so that's one thing that I'm really excited about. I gotta get Tori's made. And it's one of the best ways to start your morning. And in addition to the vitamin D dropper, if you go check out the link in the description right now, you'll also get five of these little travel packs. So that way, even if you're on the go, you'll still reap the benefits. So like I mentioned, AG1 is a part of this essentialist nutrition movement, which is basically, how do I get what's, what's essential to my life? And I actually fill Tori's up with a little bit more water, more ice to dilute it a bit. Oh, my sweet babies. Yeah, it's been a way for us to feel like we're getting everything we need, which is super important to function because, I mean, there's some days where you may even see it today where we work 16, 18 hours a day, which is a long time. It's not like that every day, or is it? <laughs> we're not doing that next year. Next no. Next year, our goal is to have a better balance, more margin, mm -hmm. healthier, mentally, physically, spiritually, et cetera. Weren't you just sharing a quote with me the other day, or what was it you were sharing? Oh, I think it was um, a post I saw that was just like, hey, if you're not getting sleep, eating right, feeding yourself, etc., then you can't show up in the way that the world needs you. And so you're not only doing yourself a disservice, but you're doing others a disservice because mm -hmm. when you're spiritually fed, mentally fed, physically fed, then you're showing up in you know the best way that you can show up and that blesses people so you got to take it all very seriously amen to that i'm gonna let her have her spiritual fed time <laughs> so this morning is a little different i mean every morning is a little different by the way i did not forget my coffee i've been on this really big cold brew kick lately and i've been loving it which I don't know why, because typically cold brew is like, it's bitter, maybe it's a little too strong for my liking. And I apologize for how close the camera is to my flipping face. We have to hurry up and get set up to record this video that's gonna go live at 10.30 a.m. And we're like, we're definitely pushing it. <laughs> <laughs> but it's one of those things where we want to be consistent on YouTube, but we also want to have some consistency in our life where we're not going to just put off eating and drinking and having our downtime because you can't pour out of an empty cup. And if our cups aren't full, then we can't offer anyone anything. Just like what Tori was sharing, where for us to operate our best and to try to encourage people more on this channel, we have to be operating our best and we have to be encouraged ourselves because you can't share what you don't have. And so hopefully the video that will now have been posted last week encouraged you. Okay guys, normally I don't have my phone out here, but I wanted to share something with y'all real quick. Actually a couple things. So the first thing is, I don't know what your morning routine looks like, but I really encourage you to have space to create space to make it a priority to have time where you're disconnected from your phone um, and you're in the stillness in the presence of god whether that's in your closet in your bathroom in the shower like wherever you feel closest to god for me i love being outside like i love feeling the breeze and right now there's a slight chill in the air which is crazy because florida's been so hot um but there's something about being in that secret place with God. In Matthew, it says, go into your room, close the door, and what you do in secret, our Father sees and he will reward. And I think there's something super special about that secret place with God where he reveals things to you and encourages you. Um, like today, I know that we'll have a lot going on and sometimes the day kind of feels like chaos, but we serve the God who calms the storm. I saw this quote the other day that said, sometimes God calms the storm, and yet other times, God calms his child inside the storm. And I wanna be the child that is calm inside the storm, inside the trial, inside the crazy, um, because I serve a God who I can trust and I know is for me and I know is good, even on my bad days. And so, anyways, I just wanna encourage y'all with that, that in the morning, put your phone away. Something I've been doing is trying to not look at social media for like the first hour that I wake up so that I just can wake up slow and put
put my armor on first, like get in God's word first, because don't be surprised when you face attacks during the day, especially if you are trying to advance the kingdom because the enemy doesn't want that. And so you have to remember that you have armor to put on every day, that you have a shield of faith that you can use to resist the attacks of the enemy. And that subtle, quiet calmness that you can have in the midst of life just shows God that you trust him. And I think that that's really important and powerful. And so praying that over all of y'all today. Love you. We gotta go film this video, this other video. Today's gonna be an interesting day though. Today's not our normal, our normal work day because we have so many errands to run and so I don't really know what's gonna end up happening um, I feel like our afternoon is gonna be a little crazy but anyways film come along with us well this is probably the fastest we've ever got a video filmed and up and ready one of the issues sometimes that we face is that it'll like process in standard definition but it won't be finished processing in, in like high res and so we always have this part where we're like, should we make it live at 10.30 a.m. Eastern time, the time we always do? Or should we wait till it totally finishes processing? Like, is it hurt the video? Does it help the video? Like, we always think about these things, but you guys know, I love to sit down and respond to comments. And so if I don't make it live at a normal time, then I think people get a little confused in terms of responding. So I like to just make it live. Tori works on the thumbnail and does a whole bunch of stuff with that. I'm titling thumbnails, and I do some of the back end sort of things, but in the description because shout out to the people who actually read the description love you guys am i good to make this live yes. it's a minute late video is up we've commented and engaged for a little while which sounds so funny but it's like part of what we love to do with youtube is actually engage with you guys chat with you guys and we've gotten our greens in had some breakfast now we're gonna run some errands and we have a lot of them, so. I just need to get out of the house, to be honest with you. You also have things out of like, the house that you've gotta get done. I was but. getting a little flustered with how much we had to do this morning, and I basically, Tori was just gonna take the errands and go do them herself, and I was like, well, I can go with you. She was just doing it to give me some space to mm -hmm. just allow me to like have Breathe. some downtime. Mm -hmm. Cause I haven't taken that yet today. Um, but honestly, I think it's just gonna help for me just to get out of the house and not just think about like, what do I have to do? What do I have to do? What do I have to do? But instead yeah. just like sit in traffic because when you're in yeah. traffic, you can't do anything. You're stuck. Yeah. When I was journaling this morning, I was praying and I was like, you know what, Lord, I want next year to be marked by calm, not chaos. Ooh. because I feel like this year we've been very like frantic. Like I feel like a lot of the time we just feel like we are in a race against the clock. Mm -hmm. Like it just feels like there's not enough hours in the day. And that's our own fault because we didn't set like the best boundaries. Well, we also purposefully did that to like we did. There was definitely purpose behind it. And it, we definitely felt like this past year was like a sacrificial year to like set the foundation mm -hmm. for like a lot of things that we want to do. But with that came like a lot of chaos and yes. stress. And so this next year, now that we do feel like we're in our home and there's a solid foundation like laid, mm -hmm. I am just praying that the year will be marked by like a calmness yeah. and a steadiness and a peace. And so, can you just feel that. that right now? Just like we're floating. Look how peaceful I look right now. Uh, okay, now let's get out into the Christmas traffic. Woo! <laughs> I love you, my babies. Love you too. Okay, well, <laughs> we've been on the road or on this Aaron journey for a lot longer than we thought we would because we were witnesses to a very bad accident. Um, Look, fortunately, everyone's safe. Everyone everyone's, is safe. Yeah. We were nervous at first. Um, it, was, it was like 20 feet in front of us. Yeah, it was pretty scary. Okay, Chad's about to run a quick little errand for his mom. How do you um, open the thing? You can't do it from the car, you have to do it from the keys. Why can't we open the trunk from the car? So, babe, just go back there and press the little button. There's gotta be a way Babe, every car has a way that you can open it from the car. There's gotta be. Oh, you tried me right there. 
<laughs> you tried me right there, babe. I didn't know that was there. Oh, guys, this is heavy. Still in the car. How long have we been in the car for? We left the house at 11. It is now 4 o'clock. We are still out and about. First, we went to Do you guys Best feel Buy. like Tori's been wearing ultra cute tops lately? Because you know me, I respond to the comments. I don't even think she sees them. But how uh -huh. many people compliment you on the shirts you've been wearing lately? Oh, thanks guys. I'll have to link them. Even Angela's mom went and got like a lavender or whatever sh color shirt, purple it was. Cute. Because she liked Cutie. the color of it. So look at all the stuff she's been wearing. And here I am. <laughs> in a black t-shirt, which by the way, is like my favorite. Okay, so. but also let me add, Chad's always like, babe, you need more basics. Basics. But what do people comment on? The cute little tops. But guess who doesn't stress out what they're gonna wear? This guy. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, what all have we done? We went to Best Buy, picked up a gift for his dad. We went to Starbucks. Did you did you say Got the name coffee. wrong? Because we went to a different name store. <laughs> Are you avoiding saying their name? We went to Dick's. <laughs> <laughs> Dick's Sporting Goods. I hate the name of that store. It is a, it's an unfortunate name. Then we went by Chad's mom's house to let Stella out and pick up some stuff and pick up some stuff to drop off. And then that where else accident, do we go? The accident happened. The accident happened. Are we just we recapping all the stuff that while. they've already seen? Yes, but I'm just, I'm letting them know. That's why we've been in the car for the last oh, four hours. I see what you're saying. And now Chad went to the bank and I actually took checks, some- dog. Some work cash. calls while he was in there. So I feel like we've also been on work calls, which is why it's low key hard for us to vlog. Cause I feel like if we're in the car and we're doing stuff, we try to multitask. We should have brought the other camera. That's what we should have done. That way we had an extra one, but. Yeah, we're vlogging on our cell phones right now because honestly, we didn't think that we'd been be in the car that long. We were gonna vlog at the house, but it, we haven't been in the house all day. It was gonna be two hours, not five hours. Anyways, now we're going to pick up a little package. A little package. Or two. We have like 14. No, we don't. We, we might have three. Put money on it. Put money on it. I'm guessing that we have six. Babe, I get the notifications too. Okay. You think we have six? Listen, if the, if the Masters fam sends us stuff for Christmas, I can't deny them. I think we have six. Oh my goodness gracious. It's just going to be all bills. <laughs> it's just, Literally. you're late on this payment. <laughs> That's all it's going to be. Oh my gosh. So anyways, that's what we've been doing, fam. Welcome to a day in our life. <laughs> it, uh, honestly, adulting is so hard. People don't prepare you enough for it. And don't let me get super controversial and talk about how they teach you stuff you don't need to know and they should teach you stuff you should know in school. But I digress. Valid. I just like writing checks and learning how to like set up your sprinkler system at your home or, you know, different things. You know, homeowner stuff. Like, like adulting stuff takes so much time. I I'm wonder like, if we should do a video of like what we've learned as new homeowners. Yeah, absolutely. It's gonna be a video of us crying for 20 minutes. <laughs> me, me. <laughs> she loves it when I tickle her, don't you? You're so weird. <laughs> me, 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 me. Love you. All right, let's Love go get you. this mail. Wait, did you put money on it? Uh, What's the mail song? Here's the, the mail, mail, it never, never fails, fails, it makes me wanna wag my tail. tail. When it comes, it, I wanna wail. Mail! Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh, new button. It's not new, but new found button. So, about that. <laughs> How'd that go, babe? I thought I won. Well, I said three and you said six and there's five. No, there's these envelopes that said consider there's one. That doesn't count. The envelope is a mailed package. That doesn't count. Is there a car? Ooh, yep. I'm out of breath. Is it time to go home? It is. Okay, we're officially home. Packages on packages. This is Chad's favorite time of the day because the sun comes in and it creates all of these beautiful Shadows, like look at that shadow from the water hitting it. This one. 
Anyways, I am going to go ahead and get ready for dinner and head to Tampa because where we're going to dinner is in this cute little area called Hyde Park. And I am not even close to done with my Christmas shopping. So I'm gonna try to get there a little early and do a little shopping. And so I might just wear the same little shirt and just put on some heels because I've been feeling the shirt all day. The power's out at the house. Tori's trying to get ready and I gotta hop on a call in like five minutes. I don't know how to open up this garage for her. That way she can leave. And I probably gotta sit in my car. I wonder, if, I wonder what happens if I pull this. I know that there's a way where if you pull something, do something, that allows you to open up the garage. Oh, is this it? I think I found it. Oh God, that's heavy. Oh my word. All right, I'm, I'm gonna try to do this. My phone's gonna die. Bye, bye, bye. So I was touching up for dinner and um, all the lights just went out. So, guess we're not touching up my hair. Hey, babe. Yeah. Good news, bad news. What? Which one do you want first? Gosh, bad news first. The bad news is, is you gotta take my car. Why? Because I can't open the garage. The good news is you don't gotta get gas anymore because my car has gas. Life, life, y'all. Life, life, life. Happens so fast. Okay, let me just preface. I'm not upset about having to drive the Kia. I love our Kia. I just haven't driven it in forever because I'm so obsessed with our Jeep. And if I'm going shopping and in traffic and everything else, I just like the bigger car. But anyways, I'm leaving now, headed to dinner. I'm gonna make a couple calls on my way there. And then hopefully I'll be there like 20 minutes early so that I can do a little shopping, but we shall see. I'm gonna stick to driving and pray I don't get hit with all of the five o'clock traffic because it is currently 5 p.m. Okay, so that all that happened super fast. I just sat in the garage in the car, talked on the phone for an hour because we had a big call with the team. I feel weird saying the team because it sounds like a flex. I don't mean it that way at all. Now I'm done. Just got to catch up some friends on a few things. And now I have another call as we organize our finances. And if you guys, I know we mentioned finishing our finance series, but we need to do that. But if you guys are actually interested, interested in that, let us know. Because obviously we don't want to create videos that you guys don't want right? Like if you guys don't want it, we won't make it. If you do want it, we will make it. So definitely let us know in the comments if you want the finance type stuff, or if you can think of another idea. So going to hop on this call now, but let me just say this. I'm super thankful for the people that are rallying around us to help us build this thing and help us act like we're a big business. Cause we're not, we're absolutely not. And so it feels cool to know that there are people that believe in us and are willing to take their time to help us strategize and plan to grow this bad boy. Great picture. <laughs> Bring it on, Bruce. There he is. <laughs> hey, you guys say hi to the vlog. Well, the pictures there, my camera's down here. Let me move my window. We are gonna go over Notion. We built out a template for Chad and Tori's finances, and it should only take like five minutes. It's very simple, but the hope is that you'll be able to use Notion for tracking their finances in the new year to kind of help them stay on top of everything. I'm so tired. I got football on made some little um, 
salami and cheese sliders with the Coca-Cola. Phone call was great, but I'm just like, mentally, I'm just like, look at my eyes right now. So maybe I'll get a second wind after I have this going. Checking in a few. Tori got home. It's a late night. Podcast time. Podcast time. And this is a special episode because we are announcing our second winner of the Amazon or Target gift card. The love letter from God says, beloved child, I love you so much and I want the best for you. Don't look at my hair. <laughs> Good morning, you guys. We <laughs> oh my gosh. Someone had a hard night. <laughs> We forgot to close out the vlog last night because we didn't finish recording until... Like, probably almost midnight. It was probably midnight. Um, and then Chad has to edit the podcast and everything after that. So it was a late night. Oh, we're about to get up and start our little morning. Fluid routine. Hey, listen, it works. Fluid routine. That just sounds weird. We I, need a new name mm, for it. I know it, if you guys have any other names for that, comment below. Mm. I know it sounds weird. It's just one of those things where it helps us get our day going. You feel yeah. alive. You feel like you have energy going and yeah. It's true. It starts it starts the day out right. And so we do want to thank Athletic Greens for sponsoring this video. And y'all don't forget, there is a link below and they are giving you guys one free year supply of the vitamin D dropper and five free travel packs with your first purchase. So don't miss out on that. Y'all will love it. It's so good for you. Invest in your health because there lies your wealth. There it is. I don't want to get out of bed. I don't either. I think we're going to close out this vlog and maybe go back to, we might, we might press snooze. The snooze lose. All right, y'all. We love ya and we'll see you in the next video. Do, 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 do.